WTFNN. Headline news update. Hi, everyone. On this fifth day of May, my pleasure to be here, Basil Chapman. Tiger Technicians Hour, 877-927-6648. Really strong move today. <clears throat> the Dow's up 396, almost 400 points as we speak, at 24,150. This is a really important uh, Yesterday's uh, intraday rally, which we were anticipating for my subscribers to my opening call, going into today, and I said probably into Wednesday, and then perhaps Thursday, we start to see a pullback again. I must say, this is a really nice rally. It's about um, at 400 points up on the Dow. I'd say it's about 130 to 150 points. It's a little bit more than I anticipated, at least for this part of the day. <clears throat> Previous re uh, recovery high on the 29th was 24,660. The low that was made uh, yesterday morning was 23,602. Uh, this is very nice action. The MACD, as I said to subscribers to my opening call, MACD is looking good. Uh, Stochastic has pulled back. Unbalanced volume is okay. But my most important ingredients right here, let me show you. Maybe I can do it this way. Uh, yeah, so I'll expand this. Look, look, look. I'm going to do it for all of the indices. You see the green line and you see the little thin black line there? That's the nine period moving average. And this is the 14 period. Look how far above, even with yesterday's turn down, look how the distance between the, the quicker moving average and the slow moving average is very strong. And that says that to get the nine under, to go negative under the 14 period moving average, you'd probably have to see a slide into the 23,200 or lower level. So, so far, this is very good action. Uh, it helps the weekly chart. Let's go to the S&P. S&P is also up quite sharply here. It's up uh, 53 at 28.95, filled in the gap. I believe it's filled. Yep, it's pretty much filled in the gap from uh, the 30th on the following session was a big um, Cap down day. Yesterday went to a lower low. So it had a high. I have this written in. I got it typed in here. Let me show you. And it has a high of uh, 29.54.86. Then you get to the QQQ. Look at this, the NDX 100. Not quite at a new recovery high, but at 220.04 on the 30th. And here it is at 219.64. I'll be back. We'll talk about the rut index. We'll talk about bonds. We'll talk about crude oil. We'll talk about gold. We'll talk about the dollar. Basil Chapman, Tiger Emissions Hour coming up. Hope you can stay for my show coming up right now. I'll be back in a minute or two. Please stay. Otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow.